Yeah, we'll... Budget is for next year. Yeah, but it hasn't been read. It's not for tomorrow. <laughs> so let's. And wait. then even those exemptions and the one D one F. Somebody will say that the one the, the, the business support scheme that they. they so somebody will say the way the speaker is behaving. What they said, no, 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 you no. You don't no, need no. them to give anybody an exemption. Me, I love Bagbino. Bagbino is great. He's a wonderful person. I mean, he he's he's a bold person. If we had people like that, if we had ten people, men, bold. Yes, he's courageous. He knows what he's about. And I doff my hat out to him. He's a, he's a great man. He was, he's totally the work the, of parliament. Who are the people? Who? Tell me who the people are. They are on social media. They are he in said, the public I, domain. I, I beg you. He said that. He, 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 let me say good morning to your viewers. Let me say good morning to my best friend, Abdul Dan Latif. Mm. He had a great, um, I'm tired though. He had a great walk at the weekend. You said what? Abdul Dan Latif, who is he? You've upgraded him the, from friend to best friend. The MP for Ablekuma Central. Okay. Were you at the walk? <laughs> no, I was in Kumasi. Oh, okay. So you see, when in, the, in speakers, I came because of you today. Thank you. Very, we are grateful. Very early in the morning, I set off. It was early, 1 a.m. So the point is that mm, the speaker, when he responded, mm. he quoted Article 296 because he said that he cannot use discretion to honor the request of Afanyo Makin. MPP is a very laughable party. So they wanted to do government business and they wasted time up and down. They were looking at constitutional issues. because Just was an because of spiritual issues, they couldn't sit at a certain place. That if they go and sit there spiritually, it was wrong. This is where it has landed them. That is what Afenyo Markin said. He said because of spiritual issues, no, they cannot no, sit no, at them. Ah, it was on TV. You are misquoting him. Ah, Let's me, be fair. what is fair? Can I go ahead? You, I didn't disrupt her. Mm, yes. no, I'm taking notice. Please, so, uh, check it. Her. Heckling. 296. Okay, I hope that's not a strategy for today. No, no. I, I won't agree. Okay, please 296. Go. That is what Speaker Bagbin quoted. A and B. Where in this constitution or in any other law, discretionary power is vested in any person or authority, that discretionary power shall be deemed to imply a duty to be fair and candid. You me. Why is he being fair and candid? What is that? He's being fair and candid. He's saying that in the business of parliament, it is both outside and inside, at the plenary and at the constituency. At this time that we are here, members of parliament are doing the other side, and that is the constituency. Mm. And you cannot call them back when it is nine days to an election. Do you get me? How insensitive can a senior marking be to even think and conjecture that the people, MPs, PCs, who are campaigning outside of the jurisdiction of Accra should take, some take two days to travel to Accra. Two days travel, another two days to sit to discuss 22 matters that you cannot even finish. Use four days out of the nine to come and do their bidding. So that would be six days in all? Yes. Travel in, out, and uh, then do the work? Work. Out of nine? Out of nine days. You think that's, uh, that, ca that cannot be a sacrifice I... for Ghana? This, 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 this is not Ghana. This is MPP. They say, hey, what government business? The budget can be read after 7 December. 7 December will be still, up to 7 January will still be the eighth parliament. It won't be the ninth parliament. So nobody can frustrate anybody, force anybody's hand to come. Mm. When they were supposed to sit in that chamber, they walked out because of spiritual matters. The B says that the exercise of the discretionary power shall not be arbitrary, capricious, or biased, either by resentment, prejudice, prejudice or personal dislike and shall be in accordance with the due process of law. That is it. Whatever he has done here, 
It is not biased. It is not by resenting. He, he's not resenting anybody. It's not by prejudice. Do you get me? He's going through the due process. That's why he's quoted two nicely. He's quoted some... Are you saying that because um, Afenyo Makin and the rest of the majority decided to... Which majority is that? Please don't go there. There's okay. no majority in the House. The rest of the members on his side. Okay. So are you saying that because Afenyo Makin and <laughs> his members on the side of Parliament decided to take the route of legality. As a result of that, the speaker is also dabbling in that. The, the, the speaker is not dabbling in legality. He's, he, he's talking law. And he's dealing, if he was dabbling in legality, he would have also gone to court. He is using the Constitution. He respects the Constitution of the Republic of Ghana. And the Supreme Court did not tell speaker to open parliament. The Supreme Court, what they said was to do with the vacant seats. So nobody, Larato was saying that the Supreme Court says something the Speaker hasn't done. He has not spoken about vacant seats. He said, I cannot open Parliament at this time. He's being fair. If I have two cities as a member of Parliament and I'm in my constituency, I want to use that money not to take transport to come to Accra, mm. but to be in my constituency to help my people and also do my campaign. So I do not understand why Afenyo Markin thinks that he can write to speaker to bring people down. You see, even if he writes that the people don't come, why is he writing? They said they are majority in parliament. They should just come, all of them, from the MPP side. They come and do their business because they don't need anybody. They are okay. Majority means overwhelming. That they can come on their own. Why are they not coming on their own? Who support do they need? They don't need any support. You see, the speaker says something. He said, national interest will be served in the letter. If members exhibited conduct of honor, empathy, and humility in the performance of their duty. Empathy. If you have empathy as a leader, you know that it will not be good for you to get somebody to come all the way from Bolem and Boy, Salaga, to come to Accra. Even Kintampo. Or Tumu. Or, or Tumu. Paga. Paga. All the way. So you're, you're, you're siding with the speaker? 100% sharp. I am with him. I've always been with him and I'll always be with him. He's a great man. One of the best. None here? Yes. Lara is saying that speaker should say sorry to whom? But Umiya should say sorry to us for bringing these electric cars in town, when we are in Dumso, what do you use to charge the batteries of the electric cars? <laughs> I am asking. If somebody should tell me if I'm wrong, me, I'm a girl, and I'm a shanty girl from a crassy. What is used to charge the batteries of the electric cars for you to move? Is it not electricity? I am asking you. Somebody should tell me when we are in Dumso. So how can you bring hundred electric cars when we are in Dumso? No, I'm asking you. Me, I don't know. He is the one who should tell us that he's sorry. Why should Bagbin come and say that he's sorry to us? Papa Ro, tell me. What has Bagbin done wrong? Has he promised anything to us and he has not delivered? Somebody who said he will give us a good life. He will arrest the fall of the city. He will, he, he, he will build more factories. Now he has run to digitalization. New digitalization is not even working. The man who said that, uh, somebody has said that they are going to review free SHS and it is a lie. And it is, it, it, it is, it is not the best. He went to uh, 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 Mount Horeb prayer center to say that he's going Which to... Which Mount Horeb? At, um, at the church video at that the church, I saw. Yes, yeah. it was on your set. Yeah. He said that... that that's is, Mount Horeb. Yeah, that is your headline. He said, Baumia to improve free SHS. What is he going to improve? Something that is good, sacrosanct, there is nothing wrong. Now you are going to improve it. Papa, what is the meaning of that? Such a person should tell us sorry. Not Bagbin who is doing the right thing. Not Speaker Bagbin. I also want to say and correct everybody that Bagbin is number two, he's not number three. Because we have four arms of government. The executive. The vice president is not number two. He's part of the executive. It is one. 
two legislature, three, the judiciary and four, the fourth estate of the realm, the media. It is as simple as ABC. And for whatever it is, he's not using it for anything. This one, I'll send it to Supreme Court. Mm. Uh, yeah, so take it to Supreme you Court. You will go to Supreme Court. I'll be very happy. Yeah, they'll go no to Supreme, Supreme Court. Court. Matter the auntie, please go to Supreme, Supreme Court. Court for me. Because you can't so, say that back is number two. You, ah. you, you get me? So the point is that Bagbin has not done anything wrong. He is saying that 22 days, you can't go through all your wish list. That is going to help you. You are going to get a grant, free money. You are going to do A, B, C, D. It cannot happen. So, he cannot open parliament for you. He's holding the keys. If they like, they should go and wrestle his arm and take the keys from him.